been competing probably about, I would say about 20 years. Uh, you know, you're bringing, you're bringing a lot of uh, other people from other towns coming in here. And it's such a beautiful place out here. You got the, the creek out here. You have uh, ball games out here. I can watch the game and plus doing the barbecuing over here. The park is unbelievable, uh, great atmosphere. And it's really cool to, today. The wind's been really on our favor and uh, it's just unbelievable. Everybody should come out here and experience this. It's, it's, it's beautiful. It's a great venue. It's definitely one of our top five cookoffs that we do each year. A place that our family can come and enjoy uh, is, is really one of the things that we, we look forward to coming here. Traveling is eh. Um, but the camaraderie that you find here, you'll never find anywhere else. The reason we like coming here, it's a great cook-off, it's well run, facilities are top-notch, and uh, it's just IBCA and the Chamber do a great job of putting this thing together, and uh, it all, it's all for the cooks, and uh, it's, it's great, we love it. Shiner is one of our uh, sponsors from SCA, the State Cook-Off Association. So we're always, uh, we always love going to events and drinking Shiner beer and uh, Shiner beer is great. The location, man, this has just been a great, amazing cook-off. They've done a real good job of accommodating everybody. Everyone's been really friendly and helpful, so it's a great, great location, great menu. CJ's done a great job. Great job. You get to meet other cookers from other places, and it's awesome. And, and they're so nice over here. What you don't have, they'll come and borrow here or whatever. And that's the way we do out here. Great event to be a part of. Great to be part of the SCA and be out here representing uh, Bribe Q and making Shiner for all their contributions to our organization. There are a lot of good cooks out here today. Consistency is key. If you can get a few good walks, that's all that matters. You might not win the category, but it's the overall points that matter. It's in the hands of the judges. You just hope you get your ticket called. First place chicken. Kelly Curtis, Panther Creek. First place ribs. Pit Boss Smokers. First place brisket. Charlie Rule going south. And reserve grand champion, Kelly Curtis, Panther Creek. And grand champion, Ernest Cervantes, Burnt Bean Company. Today was pretty much a very nerve wracking thing because I've never cooked in Shiner. I've cooked for eight years. Talk about rolling out the red carpet. This is an A1 first class cook-off. From the way they take care of the cooks, the way that the community takes care of the cooks, CJ Patton rolled, uh, rolled out the red carpet for all of us. It's very seldom that we go to cook-offs where they bring it out and really make the cookers the main priority and the festival. So that was a really cool feeling. I was kind of nervous because I didn't know how good I was going to do if they liked my food. And you know, by the grace of God, they liked it. And uh, we got grand champion. China likes our food, so uh, it feels good. I know we took a great stake, but to uh, pull the first place among some of these great competitors that do this week in and week out, um, didn't think we stood a chance. Our background is barbecue. Steak is kind of hand in hand with that, but 
definitely a, a different style of cooking. And that was cooked on a one-man pan. Absolutely. I'd like to thank Danny Patton for his products. See you in Fort Worth. Ready, there. Ready, ready to go. <laughs> I got my ticket punched and looking forward to going to see the guys in Fort Worth and uh, see what we do.